So you've got a basic shape of box and we now need to add um, things to it to make it into something that can close and stay shut. So the first thing we need to add on the side down here is a glue tab. So I'm going to put a glue tab on here and I'm going to make that one and a half centimeters wide I think. So if you look down in the bottom left hand corner you can see that this is now 8.4 by 1.5 and that's going to give me a glue tab down there. I now need something to hold the lid in place. So what I'm going to add is a flap onto the top and again I'm going to make that about 1.5 down a little bit and again if I look in the bottom left hand corner I can see that that is, whoops, that is the correct size. I suppose we'll be eventually going to stop fiddling around with it. I want to round the corners on that. Now rounding corners is called filleting. And if I hold onto the arc tool and hold it down, I'm the very end of the filleting tool. I think a one centimetre round is too big. I'm going to try 0.51. Let's see how that goes. That looks fine. So I'm clicking on one side of the corner and then clicking on the second side of the corner and it produces a nice round. Now in a second, I'm going to put some um, side support panels in that the lid is going to lock into. So I'm going to zoom in on that and I'm going to put some lines in and I'm going to go up one millimetre. Oops. Obviously, we draw a line and back, and I've gone back, I think, 10 to the same thing on this side, up one millimeter, and then back and down 10. And change the delete tool from delete any to delete a small section of line, and I can take those two little pieces out one and two. And I'm going to take this piece, I'm going to copy it, I'm going to flip it over, I'm going to take it down and put it on the bottom there, so I've got a matching piece on the bottom down there. Now the side support panels um, are going to fold in and they act to hold up the top, and again, one and a half, so 1.7, 1.7. Five. there's one of them. Now I want to angle them in a bit. So I'm going to go up to that corner and then go in by one. Up to that corner, then in by one. Use my little delete a section tool. Not to take that bit out. Take that little bit in there out. And that bit, and of course that section there. Now I might decide to round them, but I don't think I'm going to. So it's exactly the same process. Copy. And paste that to there. And I've got another piece here I don't want. Just delete that. And I want two of those on the bottom as well. So copy and flip them. And I want one to go here. And another one which, well, I wanted to go there because that's, that's the wrong place. So I have to use my imagination to touch, and that actually will be in this position here. And if I zoom out, that is now my box complete, ready to cut out and fold together.